Longtime Austin educator Dr. W. Charles Aikens has died at the age of 84. Aikens High School was named after the trailblazer who had a career in Austin spanning more than five decades. Fox 7's Bridget Spencer takes a look back at his life and legacy. Aikens High School principal Brandy Hosack had a mentor who had one astounding resume, Dr. W. Charles Aikens. When she met with him, she always brought her notepad. When you get in front of a, a legend, you take those opportunities to learn. W. Charles Aikens died on Wednesday, but his love for education and his personality will live on forever. My heart is very heavy today when I found out of his passing. Very heavy because I feel like I've, I don't have a friend to call on. Austin ISD officials say Aiken's career started in 1959 as a teacher at Old Anderson High on the east side. Then in 1964, he became the first black teacher in an integrated school in Austin ISD when he was hired at Johnson High School. A trailblazer indeed. His accomplishments so noteworthy, the district named a school after him. He has shown us what it looks like to overcome adversity. And he has taught us that education, above all else, is one's greatest asset. At a time of segregation and racism, Aikens made his career a priority. He later worked as assistant principal at Johnston, Lanier, and Anderson before promoting to principal at the new Anderson High School. Despite the impressive resume, he remained humble. His personality was full of high spirits, love, and devotion to his hardworking students. Although Austin will miss him, Dr. Aiken's words will still live in the hearts of all those he touched. He says every time he gets in front of us that eagles soar. Sorry. He means it. Our kids will soar for him. In South Austin, Bridget Spencer, Fox 7 News.